is a temple. A template. We have come from the city to create a life of purpose. Our mission is to restore this land and become self-sufficient. We've got a lot of work ahead of us, but at least we'll have all the comforts of home. Okay, so why me? What do I get out of this? Um, forever ago, I was really sick. I was diagnosed with fibromyalgia, had heart surgery, and what I really hope to get out of this is ready access to organic food so that I can use my food as medicine. I'm not sure how it is in other parts of America, but here it's really expensive. And it's not really easy to find, especially when I go back home to South Carolina. So I'm hoping here I kind of make my own little food instead. What I think I get out of this is the satisfaction of finally doing what I've been reading about. I've read blogs about sustainability. I eat well. I care where my food comes from. I want to raise goats. I want to live in a way that is sustainable. I don't know what's going to happen, but I want to be prepared for it. Catastrophe or no catastrophe, I want to learn the kind of skills that will make me function on another level. Bokashi is Japanese for fermented matter. Here's the deal. You take your compost, you put it in a bucket, add a starter culture, close it in the bucket, leave it in there for two weeks, and boom, Bokashi. Step one, dig your ditch. Step two, sprinkle in your bokashi. Warning, only use a little bit because this stuff is strong. Step three, cover your ditch over with dirt. Ooh. Wow, considering this thing has been in here for eight months, it really doesn't smell too bad. Let's have a look, huh? Oh, that's gnarly. All right, Bokashi is awesome for one big reason. It's like compost, only it's been fermented. So that means it's been culturing in an anaerobic environment, which makes all the bacteria that much more powerful. So when you put this stuff in the ground, it is like turbo compost, extremely powerful. Hey, are you gonna shut up and help me or what? What's the question? Have you ever done anything like this before? Have I ever done anything like this before? I think the answers are resounding no. I have dreamed about doing things like this, but it's it hasn't happened. Um, I admit, you know what? I had a porch garden in my last place in Venice Beach, so that's as far as I've gotten into this. But eating, I know how to eat. But as far as doing it myself just like you. Uh, have you done this before? Are you kidding? No, I've never done this before. Well, I've never done this before successfully. I've tried to grow things, but I kill everything that I grow. My grandparents used to do this stuff all the time back home in South Carolina. I got to watch them, but I never really learned how. South what? Kakalaki? South Kakalaki. Mm, that's where I'm from. But I have no idea what I'm doing up here. Would you say you have a black thumb? I definitely have a black thumb. So you could be sinking this whole thing for us? I could. 
I could definitely be the Achilles heel of this entire project. It, it could come down to my black hands. Should we just quit now? <laughs> no. Okay. This is volcanic mineral clay. It's going to fortify our soil with minerals and it synergizes perfectly with Bakashi. Here's how you make it. First, take a four quart bowl and fill it halfway with water. As you can see, I've got about a quarter pint of mineral clay here. And we're going to dump it all out into the water. I live in Los Angeles. Uh, I am a entertainment professional, whatever that means, and I have to be in Los Angeles. So I figure if I'm gonna do this, it has to be somewhere in Los Angeles County. There are enclaves of this in Los Angeles, and Topanga Canyon is probably the one that feels the most far out and has the most potential to sort of do your own thing and create your own reality. So that's why, I, that's why here. That's why here. About five years ago, I moved from the Carolinas to Los Angeles for work. And I was only gonna stay a few months and life and career just blew up and took off and I never looked back and I'm still here. That said, I'm going to stay here in LA. This is where I live and work. So fortunately, Topanga Canyon is still in LA, but it's as far out as you can possibly get. And plus there's land and you can grow things. So that's why I'm here. We got a hell of a lot done today. Oh how, yeah. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling that if we keep up at this rate, chances are we can have this place cultivated by the end of the summer. What do you think? I have no idea. Either way, it's fun. Here's to a good first day. Here's to a kick-ass first day. Yeah. The power is in your hands.